hello, hello, beautiful babes. Happy Thursday. What's up with y'all? It's not morning time, believe me. It's after noon, after 12. Yes, it is. But I am just now kind of getting myself together. I was up and now I'm back laying down because baby Royal just giving her a little time to hang out with Grandma, bounce around here and all that stuff. Yep, I'm with my girl. My girl. Say hey to baby royal. Say hello, y'all. What's up, beautiful babes? And to all of those wonderful Glam Fam members over there from my mama's channel. What's up, y'all? What you got, girl? Your pacifier? You know what? She is a half and half kind of pacifier girl, you know. Sometimes, I mean, she don't be crying for it, but, you know, she, she uses it at her own disposal, like, when she wants to. And we're getting ready to get a bath. Say, I'm going to take my bath. I just woke up a little bit ago. Now it's time for bath time. So I'll see y'all in a minute. Toodles. <laughs> Now, I haven't had to have one of these in a long time. The shower in the Armester bathroom didn't need it, but the tub in this other bathroom, baby, it's slippery. I don't know how my daughter dealt with that day and day out, but girl, I'm too old. I can't be gripping my toes on that damn porcelain. So I have this and I'm going to put it down right now. Get out the way. Who got a watch? Who got the time? I'm raising the clock. Even so I imagine when I step on it, when I take my shower, it's going to secure even more, but that's perfect. Oh my gosh. Thank you, Lord. Got, got big dreams, one big rocks. I got plans, you got talk. I just want to but it's really cold house. What's up, beautiful babes? Hey. <laughs> new day, new objectives. Woo. It's bright in here. Oh my goodness. She a little bit better. And the camera is crooked. I hope I hope y'all ain't got no OCD about this crooked camera. Cause I'm about to annoy the hell out of you. I'm about to annoy the hell out of you because I'm not straightening it up. Y'all issues every freaking day. I don't know what's going on. I've been taking the ultimate care of my body skin. And I have like breakouts from everywhere. I pulled back on a lot of things. I went ahead and readjusted. I'm sticking to the same routine. You know, pretty simple. But I don't know what's going on. Uh, maybe I'm going to have to go spend some money at the doctor's office or something. I don't know. Because this is crazy. I don't even know what to do about it. And I woke up with a, another one on my arm and I'm like is something biting me you know we we wash the sheets you know every three or four days I don't know what it is it could be raw she could be putting something on me I don't know <laughs> so don't be blaming that baby anyway she's in there with her papa right now so I can get a few things done and y'all my big thing today I uh, am going to do a little bit more organizing I talked about how important it was to take care of your ugly feet. Now, I told y'all, I don't know who got the ugliest feet. If it's me or Beyonce. Maybe I didn't put it on this channel. Maybe I put it on the other channel. But listen, I've been working on my feet. So I got on my foot products and come to find out, hell, I don't ran out of most of it. Let me tell you the truth. Let me let me show y'all. This little cream right here, this Grocerisms, Grocerism, 
that's what I call it. That's what it looks like, right? Um, it is Urea 40% Cream. It's for the feet. It's for soft feet. I don't went down through there with that. So hell, that's that's an empty. It's trash. So I think I have another one though that I uh, can restock on it. So I'm just tossing stuff out. Yeah. Oh well. Let me go ahead and, and get the rest of that here. I'm such a nut when it comes to wasting products. I will not throw something away. And I know I can get a little bit more out of it. So now that's trash. I got a little bit extra. Go ahead and take care of my feet while I'm at it. Everything that's almost gone today, my feet gonna get it. Girl, what? And my feet looking cute too. I mean, it's been a long time. Like I told y'all when I did my foot care the other day, or now it's been a minute. Honey, I've been working on these feet. Mm -hmm. I have. I'm just trying to get it all together, y'all. This is my pet egg. I went ahead and I had cleaned it out because I use it here in the bathroom. Uh-oh. I forgot to put it together. <laughs> uh, it slips in some kind of way. I think like that. Nope, like this. Yeah, I had um, dipped my feet the other day. And I swear when it comes to the feet, child, it is not just a hit it and quit it kind of thing. It's a regular. You have to stay on it. But this is the one. I mean, it's such a variety of these. And I'll be thinking like, is these fake? This is the one that I got um, maybe two months ago or so from Amazon. And I don't have the top on it because I don't really use the little scrubber thing. Um, I usually use like um, that little cheese grater looking thing I showed y'all. Or I'll use a, like a pumice stone, pumice thing. I'll show y'all. We're going to get all the foot stuff done. This I'm going to leave in here. This Smile Foot Exfoliating Cream. This is some pretty good stuff. Yeah. I've been using that. Get it cleaned off, you know what I'm saying. But yeah, there's some pretty good stuff there. And this was so nice, but Avon doesn't care anymore. I think I got this, of course, from Avon, but it's from the face shop. So y'all know the face shop got some really good stuff. Now this footworks, they don't make this anymore. Um, but it was the beautiful papaya sorbet for the feet it was like a cooling lotion but it was so refreshing for the feet it's gone and i used the last of this avon footworks healthy maximum strength cracked heel cream girl like i said i've been going through my stuff i'll take those little products there with me but i'm going to organize all of my foot products and probably put them into one single thing i have different stuff here and also, where else? I just saw another thing with foot products in there. Uh, this whole tray of things right here. So we got plenty to go through. That's that foot peel I used. And that, I think I gotta order another one of those. This is some exfoliating moisture stuff here. I love all of that stuff. And this is a nice antifungal spray. Yeah, that's an antifungal spray. I haven't used it much, actually, honestly. Um, this here, oh, that's the achy foot massager. I think I've used that. It's almost probably gone. These are the last maximum strength cracked heel things that I got. This was the style of them from Avon. I think that other one was an older one, but you know, I, like I said, I squeezed the juice out of them. This again is an intensive callus cream. That's an older one. This is a soul support cushion cream. So we're going to use all that stuff up. I'm not sure why the CBD roll on is in here. Maybe I put that on my feet. And this is the powder that I don't use. I think I'll give this one to Mike. I think he uses that in his work boots and stuff like that. 
and y'all if y'all came up in the era of the like pointed shoes pointed toe shoes bunions is an issue right you know i don't have severe bunion situation but i do have a bunion situation okay so we're gonna put these on today and wear them faithfully i got another set here that i, I want to say i got a pair of that's already open but we ain't gonna worry about it we just gonna use what we can see right now oh that's the flesh color one i like those yeah gotta put this in there i dropped it on the floor cut it in here but anyway so as you can see i do have a little bit of a bunion on the side there put that on like so and see how it stretches and see how it stretches the toe out and straightens it up yeah did i put that on the wrong way i think i did i think i put the wrong one on the incorrect foot We'll do her like that. Ta da! You slide your shoe on. And I can't tell I got it on, but it really helps in when you're walking around and stuff. So, um, put this on. And you actually can leave these on. I mean, you can shower with them on and all of that jazz too. So, it won't hurt a thing. Ta da! So this can be tossed in the trash can over there. This can go in there and this can go in there. These are just some, if you have a blister on your heel or something, this can go in there. That's the cheese grater thing I was talking about to clean off your heels. Or I also use this right here. And I'm just going to take all these items into the bathroom and put them in the little cover. Now this is my other pedic. I think I've thrown the other piece away, but this is the part. I do use it periodically. And these are the other little foot scrubbers I use as well. So all of this fits nicely in here. Boom. Okay. Found an extra little thingamajig for that so stick that in there too and that frees all of that up perfectly and now i can just slide this in the bathroom and honey you know except for when i'm doing like my foot soak or something but generally i don't even use this stuff right away after the foot soak i go and i'll lotion it up i'll just go in the bathroom and do that so anyway got that done all right, all of these goodies are my dry brushes, African cloths, you know, hand exfoliating gloves and stuff like that. And actually, this little basket is kind of big. I can actually put it in a small one here. I'm just what I'm going to do and put these back in the bathroom. I got to get some. Well, actually, I have some little shelves that I can use. And y'all know what these are when you're washing your face so the water won't run down your arm. This is one of those makeup cloths that uh, helps to remove your makeup. I have a couple of different dry brushes I use. So those all go in there. These are great for like massaging your thighs and legs and buttocks for cellulite. I don't know why this one probably oil because I use the oil when I'm doing it it's kind of sticky this one I've had for years y'all I mean probably 30 years and I've forgotten the brand it was like a store in the mall that sold bath products and stuff but I've had that forever and this one I got from Avon y'all this doesn't look like it's gonna be rough but this is kind of rough man it'd be kind of rough I'm telling you it does but Anyway, I just downsized that and I have a little tray that I'm going to put in the bathroom to stack this on underneath my um, like toiletry cabinet. So let me get that and put this up. So these are the little things I was talking about. I've had them for a minute, so they're kind of dusty, just sitting around. And I'm going to 
stack them inside of the little linen closet thing at the bottom. They actually can be screwed together, but I think I'm, I can get away without screwing them in. They'll stack and stay steady like so. I have this little shelf right here in the bathroom that I can actually put this basket right in here perfectly. Of all of that goody, 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 goody stuff. Uh, the baby tub. We don't need that. She actually bathes now in the actual tub, girl. Because that thing right there, roll is so wild. She will turn it over. <laughs> so this is the bottom of the cabinet I was talking about. Uh, I just stuck my foot stuff right there. And you see all that extra space. I can actually put these little stackables under there. I guess I won't have anything actually on that bottom one. I'm not sure. Let's get it right. Uh, what's she going to do? So I just put all of my hair products, well, my, you know, my products I used to bleach my hair. I put that on the little shelves. That being right there houses my clippers. Yeah, so. This is what I use the rest of my arm on when she's in the tub. Just gonna pop it right there. Honey, that's perfect. Everything's set up. Good. So under here I have some bath items. Some bath soak. Um, this is just a body balm here. I'm going to put that up there. These are some revitalizing rosemary peppermint bath soak salts. I don't know if y'all can see me or not. Let me put that up there. And this is another lotion here. Let me put that over there somewhere. And this is my, like, water flosser thing charger and my electric toothbrush charger. Hopefully y'all can see what I'm doing here. I am just going to set those aside. And all of baby rolls, shampoos, and stuff that she uses, I'm going to put in here. Make it look organized. Oh, these are some bath salts I made, so let me put that there. Put her stuff up here. Okay. Now we got that looking cute. I need to bring her rubber ducky back. She took it out of the bathroom the other day, and and she'll be looking for it when she gets ready to take her next bath. So, oh, I need to make sure I bring it back. So, we can put all this stuff right here. And y'all, I had a whole basket full of stuff from a Connie Beauty. I forgot about <laughs> the whole thing was sitting right behind my desk in my main office. But we're going to put it all here where... It's now visible when I get ready to soak in the tub. I got all my bath soaks, my salts and stuff there. That's Baby Royal's little setup, temporary until she moves uh, for her bubble bath and stuff in my scrubs. Or should I rearrange that? <laughs> wow, let's say. Yeah, we're gonna put my stuff on top. We'll put this up here and hers down here. Yeah. Can't let her take over too much. You know what I'm saying? Nah. There we go. Now those are more of the iconic 
beauty products that came in the little basket they sent me so I am going to start utilizing it as a matter of fact last night I did use the what's it lotion it's like a lavender rose lotion spray on lotion I used that uh, today I did put out a little of this this is a nice shimmering body oil y'all I mean it's super shimmery <laughs> I mean not shimmery it just gives a glow like out of this world so I'm going to be utilizing those items the under eye patches I'm gonna stick those in the little fridge here uh, once I pop those open so yeah and there's not too much I can do with these cords it's up I just I have a fan here when I'm like trying, trying to dry my um, like serums and things like that I turn that on or if it gets too hot in here I turn it on and I'm just hanging those cords for there temporarily for now this particular toilet can't sit much on it because that's how you flush it but I just put my lotions right there for now until I clear off some things so yeah added one to the setup of my Avon senses I use that one a lot as well so that is that. Oh, y'all, excuse my dress. It's actually too long, so I nodded the ends of it. But the house shoes I have on, I got them from Amazon. These are comfortable and cute, and you can actually step outside with them if you wanted to. But let me tell y'all some that do not get. If they're going to be cheap, these right here, so cute, right? They're so cute. But let me tell you something. These damn things made my toenails black. If you get them, don't get them in black. That's for sure. So I'm getting ready to trash these right now. Because they are trash. Exactly trash. Okay. Do not get these off of Amazon. I'm going to link them below. So y'all won't buy them. Okay. <laughs> I get these. These cute. Okay. Y'all, the fragrance I've been using for like my everyday or nighttime fragrance after I take my shower has been this one I got off of Avon. The name of it is... Today, Auto Perfume. Yes, it is. Nice bottle too. Cute. I don't know if they still carry it or not, but I will link it down below if I do. And the notes... Or the top is magnolia blossoms, the middle is hibiscus petals, and the bottom is silk musk. I think that's what gets me is the musk. I love musk. And I've been loving it. You know, I have a tendency to find a perfume like it initially, and then I can't stand it anymore. But this one had to grow on me because, look, I'm using it up right now okay but I try to switch out you know periodically so but this one check it out if it's available down below well babes I'm really not doing a whole lot today but um, and just some piddly work around the house I need to work my emails they done piled up over the last couple of days um, y'all last night talking about talking about adventures last night was an adventure with baby royal this baby woke up around 11.30 p.m. and did not go to sleep again until around 7.30 a.m. Like, so, I personally need to lay it down, okay? And talking about adventures, oh my gosh, I'm so excited to share with y'all something. As you all may have seen on my social media platforms, your girl is an author. I'm an author and I have several books out now, which I think I've mentioned before on my other channel. However, I wanted to share it here, but I wanted to especially give a shout out. <laughs> oh yes, a little shameless promotion of Baby Royal's book that I wrote, Royal's Magical Island Adventure. And that author that's me okay y'all I need y'all to go cop these on Amazon as soon as possible that's the back of the cover there and that is the front and of course everything is cartoonized in a sense you know all of the graphics I did 
cartoonize them. So that's Baby Royal's image, so to speak. That's her cartoon character, okay? But this is like a little story about Royal's Magical Island Adventure, but the back pages are coloring pages for your little one. So please go check this out on Amazon. If you don't mind, I will put my author page below. And you can check out all of my publications. And I so thank you for that, y'all. Check it out. It is here. It is here. It's ready to be purchased. It's available on Amazon. So get it. You're going to be glad you did. Lots of fun here. And I'm so proud of this little booklet for sure. There'll be, there will be more coming. So stay on the lookout for those coloring books for your little ones, your grandchildren, your children, your babies. And baby, please support your girl. But anyway, that's it for today, y'all. I'm out of here. I'm actually going to get ready to go ahead and work all of these emails. I got over 700, and I'm sure most of them are junk. I wish they would stop with the mess, okay? I wish they would stop with the mess. But I'm going to do that, and um, baby Roll is asleep right now, so she'll be out for maybe a, an hour or two. So I got a chance to clean up all of that okay but i am out of here and i will see y'all on the next one take care until then y'all remember I, I said it keep your hair your face your hands and your feet looking gorgeous and always share me with your world i'll see you soon bye you, you, you. you said you want a bad one well baby i'm as bad as they come said you want a hot one yeah. You with the hottest under the sun But be careful what you wish for Make you eat your words If I'm more than what you bargain for Fun to flirt But promise to deliver Much is required Cause look at what I'm giving you